I'm going to tell you how long it'll take to recover from your muscle injury, whether it's weeks, days, or months. And we're going to get started right now. I'm Nathan M. Welcome to Physio Food. This is where we discuss physical therapy and other health related topics. I've practiced physical therapy for about seven years and I've helped recover a lot of muscle injuries in my time. This is video number one in a series on muscle injury recovery time. There will be links in the description for the rest of the videos in this series. So you just got injured and you're wondering, how long will this take? When will I get better? When will I get back to normal? Muscle injuries are called strain. Muscle strains are categorized in three groups. You have a grade one, a grade two, and a grade three muscle strain. Let me know in the comments below exactly what injuries you had in the past and how long it took for you to recover from them. Also make sure to watch until the end where I have a little tip to really help you pinpoint how long it'll take to recover from your current injury. Grade one injuries are where the muscle fibers are slightly torn and the damage is very minimal. Grade one injuries take about two to three weeks to heal and this is where you have very minimal damage to your muscle fibers. You might have some slight pain right in the area where you felt that muscle pull. I see this a lot with athletes when they're playing their sport and they pull a muscle or usually their hamstring. You may have felt a strong pull along with a lot of soreness and tightness in that area. You can probably move normally, but you would feel a lot of pain if you tried to do any uh, forceful or any high intensity type of act activities. And like I said before, these take about two to three weeks to recover um, pending no setbacks. With muscle strains, it's really easy to tweak it and set yourself back um, in your timeline of recovery. A grade two injury will take at least two to three months to recover, and that's because there's a lot more damage. Grade two injuries, about 50% of the muscle fibers are torn, so that takes a lot more healing as far as with your recovery. You might feel a lot of pain with movement and the lack of strength to perform normal and moderate tasks. A grade two injury requires a lot more patience than a grade one. So keep that in mind if that's what your doctor says you have. These injuries are very typical for your sprinters and guys who do a lot of uh, hard pushing through their legs or any type of active motion like that. Grade three injuries could take from three months all the way up to a year to recover from. In the case of a grade three sprain, the muscle is actually completely torn. You may feel severe pain and have a lot of swelling right around that, that area where that muscle injury occurred. You might even notice a large knot, like right where that pain is centralized. Most grade three muscle strains require surgery. That's why the timeline's a lot longer than your typical grade one or grade two muscle sprain or muscle strain. And these are all generalizations, so make sure you remember that when considering your injury. It's possible that your injury could take a short amount of time or a longer matter of time. Factors like age, general health, if you eat a diet with uh, great nutrition, you could probably speed up your recovery rates. But on the other hand, if you do a lot of things like drinking or smoking cigarettes, it could actually make your recovery times a lot longer. Here's the bonus tip. Consult with your physician. That's the best way to determine what grade muscle injury you have and how long you will recover from that muscle injury. YouTube is a great place to get information from people, but always go to your doctor to consult about your actual condition. If you have any questions or comments about muscle injury times, please leave them below. Also, if you're really interested about learning more about injury recovery times, make sure you watch the rest of the videos in this series. The links for all the videos will be in the description below. Be sure to click the subscribe button along with the bell icon right below just to make sure you can see videos like this in the future. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video and I hope this was helpful for you.